We're yeah. back for MLA Questions, episode four. Dope. Cheers. Yeah. What it is, what it could be, could be. What? Hey, what it is, what it could be, could be. Yeah. Hey, what yeah. it is, what yeah. it could be. Yeah. I say oh. MJ's the name, John Dope's the alias. MLA questions the game, I hope you play with us. I wanna hit Michigan, then hit everything in the radius. White folk, black folk, yellow people with Indians, hoping you all relate to this peace, love, and happiness. How could you even hate on this? Ah? Represent, represent your pocket of society. Bringing people together, that's the vibe that's inside of me. Feel me, nigga, ride with me. Gotta start. The show mean it's time to leave. Go, on, go, get some. Around, fucking around. Ugh, stop it. That you just fucking. Just I fucking, jacked up with the hand. What? That's why it's greasy and shit. It's like a stranger. Ugh. Let's go. Question one, Bush or no Bush? Yo, this is Mike Wright. Fuck bees. <laughs> <laughs> Dog, I got roll with no Bush. And here's why. I voted for Al Gore the first time. Then I voted for John Kerry. No Bush, dog. No Bush. Bush don't care about black people. All right, it's B's rocking out with MLA questions, baby. This is how we do it. When I was younger, I used to like girls with bushes because I thought it was a sign of maturity. And I used to like girls that had like the little hair trickling down their stomach, they six pass. I used to think that was sexy. But now that I'm older, I think that if you have a bush, you're dirty, not clean. So you need to clean it up a little bit, have a little sexy, maybe do some like shapes, maybe put my name in it or something like that. Cause that's what I'm rocking with. So no bush. What up? It's your boy Chip, aka YC, aka Return of the Motherfucking Mac, Mark Morrison. I'm gonna go with no bush because I just don't like bushes. That shit nasty. Hi, my name is Felicia, and I'm answering in like questions. Can I be in between? Like, in between bush? Not necessarily bald ego, but like a little buzz. Yeah. So my name is Myron, Mr. Bitch, Mr. Mr. Uh, I'm rocking with MLA questions. What up, though? No bush. No bush in the ass either. No. Ew, no. <laughs> hey, it's Gina. I'm rocking with the MLA questions. Follow me at Twitter at Gina Rads. Wait, I don't say the ad sign. <laughs> hey, it's Miss Leah J, and I'm rocking with MLA questions. Gia. No bush at all. I mean, <laughs> Up the economy. This is Labrie, aka Grilled Cheese, because I got bread and then I got cheese stacked on top of my bread and then I got more bread stacked on top of my cheese. Representing MLA questions, most like 98% of the time I would say no bush. Hello, it's Shanice, and I am working with MLA questions tonight. Bush or no bush? Yeah. What are you talking about? Depends. Well, I mean, what, well, how do you take that? Like George Bush or no George Bush? No George Bush. No George Bush. No. No Bush. Shaved. Shaved. Smooth. Smooth. Soft like baby's ass. Gia. I'm Bajaka and I'm rocking with the MLA questions. Gia. No Bush. <laughs> Not. None. None. I'm thinking dirty right now. Okay. <laughs> I'm Kevin. I'm Nick. I'm Lisa. I'm Justin. And we're, we're the, the orange, orange marsupials. marsupials. We're about to answer some Emily questions. Gia! No, no bush. bush. No bush. No, no what, bush. Yeah. Do you want bush either way? It's prickly. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, my name is Jessica with a Y, and I'm answering some Emily questions. Talk about the precedent or my under areas. <laughs> either one. No, both ways. Question two. Would you rather be with someone who is dumb but good looking or someone who's ugly and smart? I would definitely rather be with somebody that's dumb and sexy because the dumb ones are funny and I need some funny people around me. Maybe she could be on the next MLA questions or something like that. 
Dumb girls are ditzy, dumb, ditzy, down the fuck. Boy. How smart is, how smart is smart? Like a genius? Oh. Yeah, if they gonna be ugly, they gonna be smart as hell. Like, really smart. Like, well, how ugly is ugly, though? Like, damn, I don't wanna touch that bitch with a stick. Like that? Nah, it'll be it'll it'll work as far as however smart she is, she's that she, a dumb bitch. Dumb. I want the dumb bitch, dog. <laughs> Too many small print. Just give me the dumb bitch. You down for the shit? Dumb and good looking, because you could teach like a cute girl a bunch of stuff, but you really can't fix an ugly motherfucker unless you got a bunch of money to like send them plastic surgery. But then they fake. Good looking and dumb. I'll take it because I can inform them. Let know what's going on. Oh, that's better. Because then I could teach her what I want her to know. But then she could not know a bunch of stuff. But she would think everything I said was the truth. So then she pretty much do whatever I told her to do. So I'd rather have a dumb, good-looking girl. Keep it real. If I'm dating someone, right. I would be with someone smart. I can't handle dumb people. But, I mean, if it was just like, you know, hooking up with someone, obviously I would go with the good-looking person. Just not let them talk very much, you know? Yeah. Keep it quiet. <laughs> Ugly and smart, because it's just something about a smart guy to me. I like smart dudes. Gee. <laughs> I'm saying dumb, dumb and good looking. Dumb. dumb, good looking. Give me the dummies. One boob. <laughs> <laughs> dumb and good looking. I'd rather be by myself. I would go with the ugly, smart person, not the dumb person. I don't want to be with nobody dumb. I'm going to take the, the sexy, stupid person. <laughs> Question three. All of that. Yes. Question three. Do you believe in love at first sight? Absolutely. I do not believe in love at first sight. I believe that a relationship has to grow first before you can actually become in love with somebody. Yes, I do. Hmm. That's a good question. I, I say no, there isn't. But there's a such thing as that ass and them tatties. Them motherfuckers is real as shit. Ass, ass, titties, titties, ass and titties. Big booty bitches. Yes, I believe in love at first sight. Not at first sight, I believe in lust at first sight. But love, you can, you can love a person fast, but not at first sight. You have to talk to a person before you love them. No. You can't be in love with someone if you don't know anything about them. Yes, the fuck I do. And, I was watching the news the other day, and they said it's like a scientific fact that you can actually fall in love with somebody in like the first seconds worth of meeting them. Real shit. Perhaps it's possible I haven't experienced the, the, the true, like, fairy tale, lasting love at first sight, you know what I'm saying? So. No, I don't believe in love at first sight. <laughs> I did, I fell in love yesterday with the lady at McDonald's. My apple pie was just right. Oh, I love her. I want to shout out Tasha. It could be quick. I don't know about first sight. At first talking, maybe. I'd say I do. So, yeah. When I met these guys, I knew. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> to everybody who participated in episode four, I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you for rocking with the MLA questions this week. And I also appreciate everybody who's been checking out the previous three episodes. Keep watching them, checking them out, tell your friends about it, and make sure you rock with us next week for episode five. Because we're evolving, baby, every week, switching things up. All right? Take it away, Orange Marsupials. Chip.